So derivative using death. So that means use this, right? You can use this one too, um, but um, I like to use this one. It's usually easier. So. All right, so solution. So the goal is to just um, use this formula. So whenever you take a limit and you write the limit sign, you have to keep writing it every single time, right? So what I like to do is not write the limit sign. I just write this, clean it up, and then you reach the point where you can plug in zero, and then, then you write this. Okay. So let's just go ahead and start by writing this without the limit. Okay. So, so we have f of x plus h minus f of x all over h. That's a good, good first step. So it's a little slow. Ask some hard ones in the homework. Wow. Mm. All right, it's a good first step. OK, so now we just replace this, right? So this means you put x plus h's where all the x's are, right? So this is going to be equal to 7 over Hey, no, hey, it's all right, good. Made it. This is the first example, so it's good. Uh, so instead of x, it would be x plus h minus 5. Everyone see where the 5 came from? It's from there. Then minus, and then it would just be f of x now. So it would be um, 7 over x minus 5. Is that it? What's missing? The over h. Yeah, please don't forget. Right, it's very important that you structure your work and you're careful. You'll have the whole time on this test. You'll have two hours and 20 minutes, right? The test is three pages front and back, and you have plenty of room to work, so you'll be fine. If people finish in 45 minutes, don't panic, right? Just, you know, you know maybe they did bad, or maybe they did good, so, but. Hey, welcome back, all right. Yuck. Okay, any questions on that step? Everyone okay with, with that step? So first you replace all the x's with x plus h. So 7 over x plus h minus 5, then you just replace f of x with, with that, with that. Okay, so now, um, the way I do this next step is a little bit weird maybe. So we have the division sign, and, and we have the h. And then, I just, I just write down the LCD. I know it's going to be this times this. So I just know it's going to be x plus h minus 5 times x minus 5. So I do that first. So I just, I just write that down first. I just memorize that, it's just from memory. I know it's just this times this, okay? And then, then, the way I do it, again, it's a bit different than maybe how people do it. It's, it's seven, it's whatever is here, so seven, and then what's missing here to get this? X minus five, you all see that? It's what's missing, right? I, I don't know where I learned this, but I, it works. And then, and then minus, it's just fast. 7 times, what's missing here to get the LCD? X plus H minus 5, very good, very good. I mean, put, and it's in parentheses, so I'll pause here, let you, let you, let you catch up. So. Everyone okay with that step? Oh, God, 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 you get an A. It's always whatever's here times what's missing here to get the LCD. So you're missing the X minus 5, right? Because it's not there, right? Minus 7, then what's missing here? The X plus H minus 5. And then don't forget the H, right? The division in the H. Really common. Like, your work has to be correct, right? It's calculus. Like, it's... Okay, all right. Distribute, right? Let's distribute. See what happens. Research. This is going to be... 7x, so 7x minus uh, 30, 35, 35, and then minus 7x uh, minus 7h plus 35, yep. And then the bottom we have x plus h minus 5, x minus 5. And then it's all being divided by h. Yeah, by h. It's all over h. And then parentheses, parentheses. Mm -hmm. Whew, tough problem. 
Any questions so far on any of the steps? This is like a really good one. So redo, like when you're studying for your test, which is, feels like it's really soon, but it's not. You still have all, all today, you have tomorrow. Like, you know, it just feels like it's, but it's next time, right? So it feels like, it feels like there's pressure. Stuff should go away, I think. Um, let's see, the seven X's go away, yep. The 35s, yep, 35s, they go away, right? So I'm just gonna rewrite it again, in case we have negative seven H over, then we have this X, the bottom piece. And it's all over H, all over H, and it's still parentheses, right, still parentheses. I picked this one, again, because I think this is a good one, like, you know, for, for the exam. Usually there's one, I don't know what's on there, I forgot, even though I just made the test, um, but I feel like this is one that I would put on there, you know, with, with, with the fraction. It's a good one, it's good, builds character. Taking this whole thing and dividing by H, when you divide by H, what do you really multiply by? What's that called? The reciprocal, I love that word, yes, the reciprocal. So it's going to be all of this times one over H. So this, so we have x plus h minus 5, x minus 5 times the reciprocal of h, so 1 over h, yeah, because h is really h over 1, right? So when you flip it, it's just 1 over h. It's just 1 over h. And these cancel. So we get negative 7, x plus h, minus 5, uh, x minus 5. So that's, we're almost done, right? We're almost done. It's like the last step is just like a formality. It's just answering the actual question, right? So this is the, secant, the slope of the secant line. So to finish, we just have to do something with this. I erased the formula, uh, but what's missing here to have the formula? What do you have to put? The, Oh, yeah, good, ah, oh, so good. Yeah, just take the limit, good. Ah, uh, yes, yeah, so, oh, 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 let's be pro. I'm gonna write the derivative symbol too, why not, right? So f prime of x, yes. This is the limit, let's be really formal, it's an evil looking f. Limit as h approaches zero. This is a harder question too, I, I consider this like medium hard, you know, x plus h minus five, x minus 5, so the limit of this, right? And then you just have to plug in 0 for h, right? And then we're done, right? So when you do that, um, do, you, do you write the limit sign? No, yeah. Yeah, you drop, don't, don't write it, don't write it. Good, so you just do this, x minus 5, x minus 5. You could leave it like that. Oh, that's kind of weird. No one really does that. Um, p squared, yeah, yeah, so p t p typically people do this. They, they write it like this. That's it. 